what I made for my midterm project is a basically greenhouse. Now, what I did is uh, I have my LCD here displaying the moisture sensor readings which are going on inside of this miniature greenhouse. Now, as well, I have the keypad which was to be used to turn the fan on and off uh, without using the moisture reading. But, so I have these two nails on the inside of, um, of the greenhouse. And these two nails are used to uh, test the resistance between the two, hence also um, reading the moisture level inside the potted plant that would be in here. Now, what you can see is when those nails are in the water, the resistance is very low. And so when the resistance is very low, um, and it shows it here, uh, when it's below a certain uh, level, I have a relay that will turn on um, my fan. Now, my connection is kind of bad, but you can see the fan turns on when it's at a certain uh, resistance. Now, when I take the nails out or like separate them, you can see that the fan turns off. You can even hear the clicking of the relay. Now, uh, I have a battery pack hooked up here as a, as a other power source to power the fan. And then I also have on the inside here of my box, um, my LED <laughs> display wired up, my Arduino um, on the inside. And uh, I have my nails hooked up here and that gives a reading through this uh, through this setup um, to the Arduino that reads it and then that will then send the signal to my relay and my relay then continues and will switch over and turn on the fan according to the reading so I wanted to demonstrate how this relay uh, works a little bit better with these two nails now these two nails, since they're separated, have an infinite um, resistance, which would simulate a very dry soil inside of the uh, inside of the greenhouse. Um, and when they would touch, it would simulate a very uh, wet um, environment, which uh, I would want to power the fan on so that it would dry out the greenhouse. You know, kind of regulate that moisture in there <clears throat> if there were to be too much. So when these nails go ahead and touch, like so, you can see that the relay turns on. So the nails are touching, on, off, on, off. So that's how um, the fan is powered and uh, controlled in my greenhouse. Um, yeah, that's my project. I'm super excited about it because I can take this application and, uh, you know, kind of beef it up a little bit more and make it even more efficient and effective um, greenhouse. And I can make it as large or as small as I wanted. I went with a smaller one just for the use of this video right now.